Hello guys, this is Oof for Days. Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today, this is going to be script showcase number 14, and it's going to be on Dark Hub. Yes, I am aware that I've done a video on Dark Hub before. However, that video is almost two years old, and I'm pretty sure a lot has changed since um, I made my last video, and perhaps some of the scripts have been improved. So I figured I should go back and reevaluate Dark Hub because the last time I did it, I didn't really give it great scores in some of the games. Um, Normally, the three games that I test for script hubs are Strucid, Phantom Forces, and Jailbreak. However, um, I think Jailbreak is kind of falling out of favor. How? So I'm actually going to add a fourth game to the list. I'm also going to do Arsenal because that's probably the most popular like shooter on Roblox. So now I'm going to be making my standards based on Arsenal, Strucid, Phantom Forces, and Jailbreak. So we're going to be testing four games in the future script showcases for script hubs. And yeah, so that's going to be um, going forward. Haven't done a real script showcase in like a year or two, so um, this should be pretty exciting. So let's go ahead and show you guys how to get Dark Hub because I think it's changed a little bit since my last video. So you're going to go to the website. It's the same website as before, darkhub.xyz. Press script, and then you copy this load string. Even the load string might still be the same, but there's like a key system, and I'll show you what I mean in a moment. So we're going to start off with Arsenal for our first game. And then I'll go on to Strucid, Phantom Forces, and Jailbreak after that. So this is going to be the first game today. So let's go ahead and inject Synapse. I'm using Synapse X, but this should work with any free executor as well. Pretty sure it works on kernel and stuff like that. Um, I'm not sure what the best free executor is right now. I don't use free executors. I mostly just use Synapse. So let's go ahead and run this. So it says link copy to your clipboard. It's like a really bad blue color. I, I'm already not liking this too much. Paste this link in your browser and go through the ads. So, yes, unfortunately, there's an ad system. There might be a way to circumvent it, but I'm not going to endorse that because the script is free, and this is really the only way that they can be supported and keep the script going, keep the website running, you know. I understand why it does that. Oh, it still gave me a key, even though I didn't do ads. Um, normally, you have to do ads, and I already did the ads, so that's probably why I was able to get to this already. So, I'll just go ahead and copy this key. Put it into the command prompt. You just paste it in, press enter, and it should work. Yeah, valid key, loading dark hub. Okay, so, oh, here it is. So, info, dark hub, supported arsenal. Here's the people who made it. I actually know some of the people on this list, like, like, as friends. But I wasn't sponsored to make this video or anything. This is a independent review. It has nothing to do with um, knowing those people. So, it looks like Arsenal has been updated a lot um, compared to my last video, so this should be fun. So, go and turn on everything. I will turn on all the mods. I don't know what walk speed... Walk speed 10 would make you slower, am I right? Finish them quickly. Yeah, yeah, I'm walking slower. So that's a bug, they need to fix that because that's weird. Um, but I'll make my walk speed 50. I'll make my jump power like one f something. Oh, there we go. That's pretty good. All right, we'll do, all right, we'll do that. And I can also infinite jump as well. And I guess there's a third person cheat. Okay, that's kind of cool. But it kind of still has you in the center, so it's not that good. Um, you also have B hop, instant respawn, anti aim. There's lots of shit on here. Chat spam. Yeah, like there's a whole bunch of fucking shit. Yeah, this script has definitely gotten better um, Arsenal department-wise. I don't remember if I've ever reviewed Arsenal, but their Arsenal script is good. Definitely going to be giving it a pretty good score. Their ESP is also pretty good, it, it seems. I don't like that the distance is like on top of the box. I think it looks kind of uh, janky, but it does have skeleton ESP, and that's kind of cool. I just got wrecked. Oh yeah, the instant respawn works. Um, right, let's go ahead and just destroy people. Oh. Okay, so their script is detected, it looks like. So go ahead and re use a rejoiner to try to get back in the game. See if I was, that was a ban, or if that was... Okay, I was just a kick. So I don't know why that just happened. Finish them quickly. But it did, so we'll go ahead and try again. So kill all does not work. We'll see if the other stuff works. That's like kill aura, wall bang, silent aim. We'll try that stuff and we'll turn on all the gun mods again. I won't deal with these. I'll just do instant respawn. I guess there's some other fun stuff in here too. 
Rainbow gun. Oh, that's kind of cool. Rainbow hands. Rainbow hands doesn't seem to do anything. But we will do ESP for sure. I don't know if the right control is the key to close the menu. I don't think you can change it. So you just have to do right control. Not really much to it. So let's go ahead and see. Oh, rainbow hands does do something. It's just like the edge. That's weird. So let's see if the kill aura works. No, but the silent aim works. Oh, that's kind of cool. Like, look, watch how much that like shoots me back. The amount of recoil is insane. So it's not like super overpowered, but it does work pretty good if you're, you know, just playing the game. If you're looking for something like a kill wall, then this is not it. Uh, My script hub does have a kill wall that does work on Arsenal. So if you want to kill all, then I might recommend Fucker Hub V3 when it comes out. But overall, the script's pretty good. I would recommend it um, for Arsenal. It's decent. And the wall bang kind of works. Not full. It's not like a full wall bang, but it kind of works. Yeah, that mod called Semi Wallbang wasn't joking around. It, it is like it is Semi Wallbang. It seems to work sometimes and sometimes not. So, yeah, that's not not a um, inaccuracy in the mod description. That's definitely saying what it does. I guess it only works through certain surfaces though, which is really interesting. Knifing is not too great on this uh, cheat, but if you can get close enough to somebody, you might be able to pull off some pretty cool kills. Yeah, we're not recommend knifing with this with this uh, cheat, but we won, not nevertheless. Oh, you still freeze when you're dancing. Some paid cheats, you can actually move around when you dance on somebody, which is kind of cool. That's something that Fucker Hub does too. So that's Arsenal. Um, if I were to rate Arsenal, I'd say it gets a pretty good score overall. I think it would get like 8 out of 10. There's a few things that I'd like to see, but overall it's good. So we're going to go ahead and move on to the next game, and it's going to be Strucid. Uh, this right here is the game that I'm probably most famous for, other than um, Fortnite, because I used to make Fortnite content and cheat on Fortnite. So Epic, don't sue me, please. Um, anyways, yeah, so this is probably the game that, like the second most important game to my YouTube channel. So we're going to do Strucid next. I need to inject. Uh-oh. Okay, I thought I crashed. Oh, so you actually... Okay, so your key does save, which is pretty cool. So you, your key gets saved in, like, somewhere in Synapse workspace. That's pretty awesome. Glad to see that's a cool feature. So we've got aimbot, kill... Oh, they have a kill all for Strucid? I'm going to have to try that out. Um, silent aim... No wall bang, unfortunately. It's also got a trigger bot. You can choose where what um, bone you want. I don't think head is bannable anymore. I'm pretty familiar with Strucid, so I kind of know like what works and doesn't work on this game. Rejoin on Volt Kick. So it's got a Volt Kick bypass. Auto deploy. Oh, it works. Anti spectate. Sly. Um, walk speed. Flag teleports. Yeah, my friend definitely worked on this script. Item ESP. I'll have to see if the item ESP actually works. It might, it might be for old Strucid. So yeah, there's lots of fun stuff in this, actually. Lots and lots of fun stuff. Oh, so the... Oh, so those emotes... Oh, so their emote hack is actually um, server-sided. I think I actually helped my friend make that um, cheat. Pretty sure... It, not server-sided, but maybe there's a trick to it. And there's something going on here. Some bug that's making errors in my Synapse console.
Oh yeah, this is definitely good. For a free cheat, this is really good for this game. Dark Hub has definitely come a long way on Strusic. And um, the one of the developers I know, and I think I actually helped him uh, with some of this stuff. So you can partially thank me for this script being so good. Um, I decided to be kind and told him a little bit of how I did things. Must say though, cheating for this game is pretty boring, and um, because of Dark Hub, pretty much all of Strusit is infested with cheaters. So if you want something that will actually kill Dark Hub players, you're gonna have to find something that's better than Dark Hub. And there's a few scripts that might qualify for that title. The kill all does not work. I I can say that right now. The kill all does not work because I'm not killing anybody. Well, actually, maybe it's working now. No, kill all doesn't work. Maybe maybe it to be a certain distance to players for it to work. I don't know. Let me see what let me see what's going on. Oh, it looks like it's working now. Maybe. No, the the, the kill all seems to be having trouble now my whole game's fucking broken so yeah i guess the kill all doesn't work but everything else seems to work pretty good so i can give it that oh there we go that's how it works okay that's overpowered as fuck And this works from any distance. It, don't, it doesn't matter how far they are. Th this will kill anybody. That's pretty impressive. This is good stuff. Yeah, this Drusa script has definitely improved since the last time I recorded a video about it. Let's go ahead and try it on Zone Worse. Oops. I gotta turn off. I gotta turn that off. Uh, where was it at? Don't worse. Let's try this. Let's try this out. I don't know if it has Q on teleport feature. Probably not. No, I have to rerun it. Let me go ahead and execute again. Let's see if it works in this game mode. Yes, it does. All right, so we're gonna turn on all this stuff. Oh, so the kill all does not exist on Zone Wars mode. So that's interesting. So there must be a like an anti-cheat. Strucid has weird discrepancies with anti-cheats, so it's definitely possible that something happened there. Except it looks like my uh, uh, spectator thing is broken. Oh, there's another cheater in the game too. She loved pain. I'll just go kick them for the hell of it. And then it'll just be me cheating in the server. Um. There we go. Alright. Huh. Wallbang works in this game mode. Yeah, their shoes and script has definitely come a long way since the last time I reviewed it.
Oh, what the fuck's going on with the fly? Fly's bugging. Sending me in the wrong direction. Uh, what the fuck? Okay. Well... Alright, now it's working. So I guess the knockback from the flint pistol uh, kind of fucks around with the fly a little bit. But if you turn it off and turn it on, it probably works just fine. Or if you respawn. Alright, so that's Strucid. Um, that was very fun, and I'm actually very impressed with um, this script specifically. Um, 10 out of 10. Very good. Um, whoever made this for Dark Hub, you did a very good job for Strucid. Very, very good job. It's one of the first times I've ever given a, a, a hub 10 out of 10 for Strucid. Alright, next game is Phantom Forces. I'm gonna go ahead and pause till it's loaded. Alright, it's loaded. It took a moment. But we are here. We got this going. We're gonna go ahead and fire up Dark Hub as soon as this screen goes away. I swear to God, this game's like loading at a fucking GTA Online. Alright, go ahead and inject signups. All right, execute. I really like that automatic um, key check feature. That's really good. Um, support Advanced Forces. Nice. Go ahead and load her up. So it looks pretty basic, but they do have some gun mods that we're going to get to have some fun with. We will do Salon Aim and probably just that. And FOV. Actually, I don't, do, you have to, do you have to use FOV? I'm not sure. I'll just make mine 210 or something like that. I don't like the UI in the way that you can't actually um, input the value, or if there is a way, I don't know how. Gun mods, go ahead and turn on all this stuff. This stuff's all pretty good stuff. Um, ESP is very basic on this. No name ESP or anything like that. Pay script hubs have a lot more features for this game. So this game might not be as, say, spiritual. Um, in terms of like, it's gonna, it's rating, it's not gonna get a very good score, I don't think. But, I'll go and give it a shot, maybe it'll surprise me. Huh, it's patched. Looks like it's not working correctly. Alright, we'll go and try that again. Okay, let me go ahead and... I'll try to change a few things and see if I can fix it. Fuck. I'll turn on visibility check, too. Alright, so it looks like I'm having trouble with Phantom Force. It looks like it probably doesn't work, unfortunately, which is a bummer. Because I don't even have um, gun mods turned on and it's not working correctly. So, I don't think Phantom Forces really works that well. So, unfortunately for this game, I'm going to go ahead and have to quit and um, give my score for that game. That game, I'd give it 3 out of 10. It needs work. I think it needs work. First of all, it needs to be fixed, and second of all, there's some features that I'd like to see. All right, so our last game is Jailbreak. I did this one last time, and this is the game where this hub really, really shined um, when I last did this showcase. Go ahead and execute. We'll see what it's got for us. Um, hello? Oh, there it is. Okay. It just cleared the console. So here we are. Let's see. Please give it some time to load. Oh, sh oh yeah, it's got hella shit on here. It's even got, like, a thing for sending its own notifications. That's kind of cool. What the fuck? It's got a whole bunch of stuff. Can you actually do that? Oh uh, yeah, there's lots of shit on here, man. It's still, still a good cheat. Almost just as good as it was before. So let's see if the teleports work. Let's go to the one million shop. Uh. Hello. Um. Okay, I'm gonna reset.
well, it appears that my uh, character is very broken now, which is always nice. All right, we're going to have to go and, re go and rejoin. So it looks like the teleports are patched. They don't work correctly. This game was just recently updated not too long ago, so that could have a um, explanation behind it. Yeah, walk speed works. I'll make my jump power a little bit higher. Oh shit, uh, that, that's gonna make me... Oh, actually it doesn't make me pass out. Nice. There's also infinite jump, no clip. I don't think no clip works correctly because there's like a server-sided check for stuff. Like if I walk through certain things, if I walk into here, it's gonna kick me out. Yeah, see, there's a server-sided check for some buildings. Um, this is one of them. And also this is one of them as well. Uh, I can't even get out. Alright, let's see. So... There's some buildings that you can't no clip through because there's server sided checks. Um, right, right here. Yeah, it doesn't work. What the hell? But yeah, so there's some buildings where you're not going to be able to use um, no clip. But that's not really Dark Hub's fault. That's something that the game that Jailbreak did. See, I can't even get into this building. So, I guess there's a check where you have to go through a certain door, uh, doorway to get inside a building. See? You have to go through a doorway. That's actually a really good um, thing to add because that really makes it much harder to cheat in this game and get through a bunch of stuff. Fixes a lot of exploits. So, props to Jailbreak for doing that. No ragdoll. Oh, that's a good cheat for this game because you ragdoll a lot in this game. So, there's pretty good stuff in here. Remove suit. That works. No wait E instant. So you can oh look at this. So you have instant arrest and stuff like that. That's pretty cool. Let's try that. Let's try the no wait E out. Out. This is gonna be so much fun. Boom! Instant arrest. Come here, fucker. What's up, fuckers? Boom. 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 These guys are too close to each other. I don't trust them. Alright, this is a lot of fun. This Doing this is a lot of fun. Because you can absolutely troll people with this. E, spammy, spammy. And all things should come to an end. Bam. Auto arrest. It's not it's basically almost auto arrest. You're just spamming E until they get arrested. And there's no cooldown. So they can't just run away from you or anything like that. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. This is definitely a great cheat that I would recommend for Jailbreak overall. There's a few things that don't work, like the teleports are buggy. But other than the teleports, everything else seems to work really good. So let's go ahead and go over to Maddie Love here and just buck her ass. I can't even, I can't even go over a fucking fence. Wow. Jailbreak went hardcore with whatever check that is. That's very impressive. Come on, dude. Yeah, I'm going to turn off no clip because it's making me... Um, bug out. Alright, we're gonna, turn, we're gonna turn that off. And just... Do this without no clip. There we go. He's auto-arrested, basically. Boom. Boom. And because you have ESP hacks, you can basically trace every criminal down. So you could just do this for hours if you wanted to. Bada-bing, bada-bop, bada-bam. Ambush. Boom, he's done. You're done. Uh, what the fuck? Boom. Um, it's lagging. Hello? Server? There we go. It was having trouble. But almost every single time, it just lets me instantly nail somebody. And it looks like there's a criminal playing with a cop over here. I'm gonna ruin his fun. Oh yeah, it's a criminal playing with a cop. We're gonna have some fun gone so unfortunately um i guess you can't go faster than this in the game based on what i've seen oh on land our mods so there's there's lots of fun stuff here I, oh i can far fly that's cool oh i'm gonna i'm gonna see if that works so there's lots of fun stuff that you can do in the world like you can i guess explode the wall over and over again which is cool so we're gonna try that out Oh, that's fucking funny. 
<laughs> oh, that's fucking amazing. Oh, he's going into the gun store. Big mistake. You're both you're both fucked. Oh wait, he didn't get arrested. Alright, now he's done. So yeah, this is a lot of fun stuff right here. Um, I really enjoy doing this. This is a lot of fun. Oh, here's another guy on foot. Boom. Oh, he didn't get arrested. Fuck. I'm a fucking rookie. Alright. Done. And he's gone. Alright, so, um, that was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed doing that one. That one was a lot of fun, actually. Um, just going around the map at instant arresting people. So, for Jailbreak, I give it a 9 out of 10. There's a few things that need to be fixed, like the teleports, but overall, it's a good script. So, I recommend it. The only game I don't really recommend right now is Phantom Forces, but hopefully that gets updated and fixed. And then, if that gets fixed, then overall, I still recommend Dark Hub. Before, I didn't recommend it as much, but now I recommend it more, so... Thank you guys for watching this video, and I hope you found it helpful um, in terms of like whether or not you decide to use this script. Again, use it at your own risk. I'm not responsible for any bans you get from using these scripts and any free executors as well. Just a disclaimer. But yeah, that's it. Peace out, guys.